Hi friends and welcome to the video here for Aries for the weekend. I'm doing a weekend message and we'll see what's coming up in your energies, Aries. Okay, so spirits, angels, and guides, please show us for Aries. What do they need to see or acknowledge? Upcoming weekend messages. Let's do a next 48 for Aries. Next 48 for Aries. Okay, spirit and angels, please show us what's coming up for Aries here. What do they need to see? What do they need to acknowledge? Four of Swords. There's no communication. There's an, a need for healing and rest. Maybe some painful words were said. Oh my goodness. Look, we got the star card. We've got the tower. Root of the issue is a change with the death. The devil's underlying. And the moon. Ooh, something toxic. Okay. What do we have here, Aries? What's closing out your cycle? Page of the Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sag. You're very persistent. You're not giving up on this situation. You're looking at the value, Seven of Pentacles. Your energy is compromising, Two of Pentacles. What's around you, Aries, here? The world. A completion of a cycle. Something's gone full circle. You want justice. And what's the outcome for Aries for the next 48? Page of Cups. Okay, you're very innocent in something. You could be getting some good news. You're waiting. Uh, there's other people involved in a situation here. There's some secrecy. Leo energy involved. Memories of the past. Healing and letting go. There's a change. There's a ten of pentacles. So there's a long-term commitment. Money. Property. The devil is still there. Something toxic. So you're waiting for something to change, and it will change. You want it to be made fair, balanced, and equal. What's behind the devil? Something you don't know. And Two of Cups, something in a relationship where something is being given to you or offered to you. Powerful, overwhelming feeling. feeling someone's avoiding and holding back their energy. Okay, so let's see what's coming in. Just going to do this one more time and see what we get. Okay, Aries. Okay, show us Aries. Show us Aries. You get a new pentacle. Okay. And what is this new pentacle? the emperor so just because it's the queen of the water pisces cancer scorpio the challenge is power you're being compassionate there's a king of the water here an energetic match there's a tower here a shake-up or a surprise and uh, we have here the judgment coming in. So a big awakening. What is this about? Your energy is the Empress. Or you could be very worried about someone here. Nine of Swords. Three of Cups is your energy. Or what you're hoping for. Queen of Pentacles is the outcome. Two of Swords. 
And what's this about? You don't want to give up on something. Nine of Wands is consistently the energy. Why are you having to make a tough choice? The Chariot, you're very determined to move forward. I have to turn down this lamp. It is six of air. Things will get easier. Okay, so hopefully that's a little better. All right, so the Chariot is consistent. The six of air is consistent. But there is something that's like a shock or a surprise. It looks like it's something beyond your control. Okay. It's a judgment here, which is, you know, karma. It's an awakening. What is this going on here for you, Aries? What is the judgment coming up in the future? A ten of pentacles. A lot of money, a large investment, a big loan. Um, maybe it's a property you're buying. Why do we have here the tower? Why do we have the tower? Three of cups, other people involved. Why are you worried here, nine of swords? It's something in a partnership with the two of cups. What is the outcome here? With the chariot, the strength. What is the chariot? Confusion. Why is the chariot with the queen of pentacles the outcome? The lovers? What is the empress around you here, Aries? Fear. King of Coin, Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo. What do we have as the outcome? Okay, the tower is showing. So there's something that's like a shock or a surprise. Something you didn't expect. Six of Air, things get easier. What's this outcome about? Wow, okay. Having to stand your ground. Having to stand your ground. And this energy was here... Uh, it was here behind the energies. Seven of Wands to the change. Okay. Uh, what do we have here as Aries energy? You're doing something with patience. Why is there the tower here with the Three of Cups? Nine of Swords consistent. It's something that is concerning you. Um not concerning you it's on your mind you need a solution you need an answer the knight of cups comes forward someone comes forward with their emotions or their feelings why is the ten of pentacles here coming up in the future it's something about a five of wands it's a competitive it's a situation where there's conflict four of coins somebody's holding back what's underlying Somebody wants to walk away, Eight of Cups. They want to depart. They want to leave. Ooh, and the Death card. Okay. The change. The shocking change. Okay. Show us what else. Show us um, some more energies for the Zodiac sign of Aries. Page of Fire. I think that was your past energy. You're excited? No. Somebody may have taken a risk and it, it didn't turn out the way they had hoped. They're getting some information or some news that could be kind of upsetting or disruptive in some manner. Your energy is like, you know, when, you, when you're in a nine of swords, it means you need the answers or the information you're getting is like, you don't have a solution. You don't have an immediate solution. You don't, you know, either somebody won't talk to you or they won't give you the answers or that nobody knows. You know, it could be... Sorry, my hair is like... Okay, so it could be that nobody knows. So you're determined to go forward. You're not going to give up here. Um, there is some kind of shocking event that happens... And there's other people involved. Um, okay, so let's see. 
Somebody wants to walk away with this Eight of Cups energy. Maybe it's you. Maybe you want to walk away from something. You're saying, you know what, it's not worth it. I don't want to do it. Um, I'm not interested. I don't even care that much. I did, but now I don't. Show us for Aries for the next 48. The Page of Pentacles, a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. It could be a message about money, a message about a pentacle. <sighs> There's like a resistance to change, okay? So there's a need for change, but a resistance to change. Okay, show us here for Aries for the next 48. Let's take popping cards. Four of Swords again. Communication is not there. Either you need to heal or you're just not getting the communication you need. The Page of Pentacles comes in in the crossing. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo energies. The Fool. Somebody took a leap of faith or a risk. Four of Pentacles. Somebody is not... There's this resistance or this pulling back. Oh my God. So we've got the tower. And we've got the devil. Okay. Somebody may have done something that they shouldn't have done. They contacted someone they shouldn't have contacted. They did something that's limiting their energy. They dealt with someone they shouldn't have dealt with. They took a risk. You're kind of mad here. You come in Knight of Swords. You also came in Knight of Cups. Or no, the Knight of Cups comes to you. The death, okay. Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag, and the, the Two of Cups is the outcome. It brings you closer together, this change. The Star, a complete and total healing and letting go. Five of Swords, somebody feels like they deserve something. They deserve to win. Two of Pentacles, there is a willingness to compromise. Five of Pentacles, something is left out in the cold or not included or not given. And a Five of Wands, there is a struggle. And Five of Cups, there's a disappointment. What is this tower and the death here? What is the tower and the death? Something has to be done right away. Two of Rods or someone's at a crossroads. Knight of Pentacles. Somebody's very loyal. The Strength card could be Leo. Ten of Cups, Temperance, Empress, and King of Pentacles. There's a lot of happiness here with this. Or a lot of emotions invested. King of the Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. What's the death? What's the death in the environment? Very powerful feelings, Ace of Cups and Six of Pentacles. Something is being given here. Very strong, powerful feelings, Six of Cups. But something closes out the cycle with the death. Like it changes. Ace of Wands, surprising High Priestess listening to your intuition. What's this Two of Cups about as the outcome? What's this Two of Cups about as the outcome? The Seven of Cups. Many choices. The Chariot, again. Okay, so determined to move forward. Chariot can also be travel. Last minute travel. Why are you Knight of Swords? Uh, you feel like there's a resistance here. Eight of Swords. Five of Coin, Five of Wands, Eight of Swords. You're very concerned about this situation. It, like I said, it may feel like there's no solution to something. 
What comes in here? Treasure Island. Okay. A lot of abundance. The Treasure Island is a lot. A lot of money, a lot of funds. The truth be told. And a soulmate. Wow, okay. Soulmate card coming in. Wow, happy, happy. This is a nice card. So I don't feel like this tower is a bad one. I feel like you're just not expecting it with the yin. It's emotional. All the glitters isn't gold and exchanging gifts. Having a deep sense of knowing and the fire. Just You can't surprise the psychic. <laughs> a psychic will know. You'll be like opening the door as the person's arriving. Like, oh, hi. <laughs> okay. I've actually done that so many times. Um, especially if you're a clairvoyant or clairaudient. You could see that they're coming. You could hear the conversations. You could hear the words. Date night. Get ready to be wined and dined. Aries. Proceed with caution and keep your... Di Somebody may feel like they're distant from you. Being distant. water sign Pisces cancer or Scorpio okay the death is a Scorpio energy you have a lot of life cycle energies around you here Aries a lot of things could be changing let's see the magician The Angel of Love, Archangel Raphael, and Archangel Gabriel. So, the messenger of healing, the messenger of uh, important news, envy, and feeling held back. The doorway to spirit. And appreciation. Okay. Door to romance. Anything else? Joy. The third chakra. Solar plexus. Okay, so you're consistently ending with success here. So let me get one from... The Kipper Oracle. Let's see what's coming in for Aries. Please show us angel spirits and guides. The pathway. You're coming out of some kind of situation where there's light at the end of the tunnel. Sudden wealth. Wow. You did have that Ten of Pentacles show up. Pathway and change. You're on someone's mind. Okay. Well, that's what I have for you, Aries, for the weekend, for the next 48 hours. I hope you guys have a great weekend ahead of you. I'll see you next time, Aries. Take care.